When you do this, you've got to be able to do it for days and not hours. So if you're going to watch video for two hours, you don't want that to be most of your battery life or all of your battery life. Uh, you've got to be able to listen to audio. If, if you carry this around in your backpack, kids carry it on campus, they're going to listen to audio um, you know, out of their backpack for a day at a time. So what we're capable of doing with the Tegra platforms is literally listen to music for 25 days. That's almost a month of listening to music on a single battery. Uh, that compares to about five hours on atom-based systems and probably about 60 hours or less than one-tenth of work people we're doing on Snapdragon systems. These are the two people you hear a lot about this week. So again, when, when you see these demos, I want you to think about what you saw here and try to compare that both from a performance and a power standpoint. HD video, I think you saw some pretty cool videos here with us today. You can do that for 10 hours on a small on netbook size battery. Um, the other, the other uh, guys, Snapdragon, can't do that at all, and it's only a couple hours on an atom. And then finally, you just heard from Adobe, flash acceleration is going to be critical to being able to do great flash and have a great experience on the web for a long period of time. We partner deeply with them to be able to go off and do that, and this is, uh, uh, I think you've seen some of that today, and you'll continue to see us work closely together as new versions of flash come out.